Hi, I'm Tracy Mallet, working here on the Allegro 2 with the Infinity Bar. What I love about this Infinity Bar is it moves, but the carriage is not moving. We're actually going to move the bar. So this next series of exercises is going to be really working on spinal articulation, really working through that thoracic spine, and also stretching out that lower back. So definitely exercises that you don't want to miss. So let's get going. For this series of exercises, we're going to be having the infinity bar able to move forwards and back. We're going to go into spine stretch and our classic mermaid with the infinity bar moving with the body, which is so fantastic. We're going to have it just at um, one blue spring because the carriage isn't moving. The bar is moving, which is what's so different. We're going to face the bar, pop your feet through reach towards the bar, place the hands down, now press your hands down into the bar, draw your shoulder blades down and back so you can really feel the lats, the serratus there, press down. Now from here we're going to reach the bar forward, curl as much as you can in that C curve position and then we exhale and roll yourself all the way back, lift up to a straight spine. Inhale here, Exhale, scoop out through the lower abs, reach towards your toes as you push the bar forwards. Now initiating from your lower abs, stacking each vertebra one by one until the shoulders stack on top of the hips. One more time. Inhale, exhale, initiating from the core, press down into your bar, connect your arms to your back as you reach forwards, reaching past your toes in that amazing stretch. And then we curl back again, working through the spine. From here, we're going to take the back hand in the center. We're going to push our hand behind your head. From here, we're going to push and add a rotation. And then curl back into center. Lift up, open the arm. Rotate as you push away. So you've got spinal rotation and then curl, draw those abs in and curl back. Let's do one more. Open out, lead with the chest, your sternum, and then exhale, come back. Switch to the other side, hand behind your head, push out and rotate, look towards your back elbow, and then close the elbow forwards as you curve back through the spine. And again, the spine moves. And then the spine curls back. Inhale, which facilitates the extension. And you're looking back to that shoulder and elbow. And then we curl back again. Doesn't that feel so great? Now moving on to the series, we're gonna turn forwards. We're gonna go into your mermaids. We're gonna just push that bar out a little bit. Come into your mermaid position here. Hand in the middle. Depress your scapula first before you move out, going over into your mermaid, and then bring it back, press your hand down as you really activate your lats, and take the hand down. Let's try that again. Depress, lat serratus obliques, push out into that stretch, and then curl back. Now we're gonna add the rotation. So we continue the journey, we go over, we add the rotation and we push away. Now if you can, we're gonna lengthen that leg out. We bend the knee, we curl back and then we turn the body and bring the hand down. Let's do that again. Lift up, reach out, rotate your body, look down to the floor, elongate that back leg out in that leg lift. And then we curl back, release the bar, depress your scapula, and come all the way back, finishing off with that reverse mermaid there, hand behind your head, and rotate around. Let's try the other side, so we're gonna turn. Here we go. Push out, mermaid over, 
press the hand down, shoulder blade depresses as we bring the bar back. Really depress here, push out. Lengthen, lift over in that side bend. Press the hand down, feel your lats, feel those obliques and bring it back. Shall we try the rotation now? Or you want to continue in that nice journey going over, rotate around, lift that leg up and then bend, rotate and bring the carriage back. Let's try that again. Push out, depress, lift up and over in that side bend, rotate your body, lift that back leg out, love that stretch, lengthen someone's pulling on your leg. Try not to sink between your arms though, that's the most important part. And then we come back, we bring the hand down and we can finish off that stretch in that nice side stretch here. Hold it there. And we can always put a hand behind the head. I love that little extra stretch here. If you want to go for that stretch or just continue there and then release. Awesome work, so great. Stretching out the lower back, the QL, the quadratus lumborum and your lower back. Spinal articulation with the beautiful use of this actual bar, the infinity bar. One little tip I must say, always remember, to depress, you press down resistance to engage your last, your serratus, and all those abdominal muscles there as you pull in up and back. Awesome work, look forward to seeing you back here. Have an amazing day, goodbye.